you hit your written steam. Is there a need for an organisation like Citizen 21 today? Yeah, I think so. I think in, in Denmark, uh, citizenship is one of our core values, something that, that we always discuss and talk a lot about. And I think definitely in the current situation in Denmark, citizenship is under a strong pressure. So I think a new movement in Denmark that will fight for uh, the strength traditionally in the Danish citizenship and maybe even suggest new ideas how to improve it are very important. Citizenship is under pressure. What do you mean by that? I mean that we in Danish society today are um, making so much new regulations that are actually creating a sort of an A and B team uh, within the citizens. So we're not all together surrounded in, in the nation Denmark. There is a, a greater and growing, I think, division uh, between people. And we are forgetting some of the core values that we built Denmark upon, which I certainly think that inclusion is very important. And Right now, we are excluding a lot of people uh, from the Danish society. And you think Citizen 21 will be the route or a route to do this? I think it will be a route. I think there are many paths and many ways, and we are, I think, already many organizations that fight for some of these core cool democratic values and citizenship. So uh, I think there will be many that will be standing and fighting together. A long fight? I think so. We're in for a long haul, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's interesting. Stay in Tangwes, indeed. Michael Lane for the Coning Voice.